With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we're going to see this question. The question says that a monkey is sitting on a branch of a tree which is 20 meters high and drops a mango directly above the head of the boy. Okay. As he runs with a speed of 1.5 meter per second under the tree. How far behind the boy does the mango drop hits the ground? So basically what is happening in the question? Basically, let's suppose there is a tree. Okay. There's a tree and on it, there is a monkey. Okay. So let's suppose this is the tree and on this is the tree. And on this, there is a monkey. Okay, this is the monkey. And there is a boy just below the tree who is going past the tree. Okay, with a velocity v which is uh, 1.5 meter per second. Okay, 1.5 meter per second. Okay, so this monkey drops a mango. Okay, he drops a mango like this. Okay, with no velocity, basically, he drops it. Basically, so. And basically, this height above, uh, for which the mango will travel will be 20 meters. So, firstly, what we'll do, we'll find at what time the mango hits the ground. Because it will not hit the ground when the boy is over here. Because the boy will already be moved because he is moving with a speed of 1.5 meter per second. So, about mango, about mango, if we see. So, about mango, what we'll see? U initial velocity is basically 0. Initial velocity is 0 acceleration is equal to g and basically the x s which is the distance traveled is 20 meters and we have to find basically what is t so which uh, which equation we will use we'll use the second equation that is v is equal to u plus at so by using the second equation s is equal to basically not second equation is ut plus half at square not v is equal to u plus at it is the first equation so uh, s is equal to ut plus half at square so this is we are going to use so s will be equal to 20 ut quantity will become 0 because u is 0 plus half into a is basically 10 into t square okay so we will get what we'll get the value that is so this and this will get cancelled by 5 times so t square will come out to be 4 that this means that t must be equal to 2 2 seconds okay so in 2 seconds the mango reaches from here to here so the boy will travel how much distance traveled by boy distance Traveled by boy, traveled by boy, when mango hits ground, okay, mango hits the ground, will be equal to what? It will be simply velocity of boy into time, okay. Because the, the boy is not accelerating in any kind. So 1.5 into 2 which will be equal to 3 meters. Okay. So the bango will fall 3 meters behind the boy. So our answer will be 3 meters. Got it? Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.